Hey guys, Blue Yoshi here, and welcome back to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last time we obtained a spirit orb from the woodland stable. We fought an ice wizard who granted us an ice rod for our troubles and made our way, everyone, to the Woodlands Tower, and today we continue on our quest and journey to explore the Woodland Tower and see what lies before us here. So, I'm here with my brother Micah today, <laughs> and he's going to be doing commentary with me as we go into the 31st episode here of the Legends Out of Breath of the Wild, and I have accidentally fallen. <laughs> All right, a great sign for things to come already, everyone. All right. All right well, that guy's dead. <laughs> Just snuck up behind him, and now he's done. All right. Which sounds dangerous, is what it sounds like. All right, so, uh... Yeah, now, before we start off what's going on here, uh, some of you guys may have noticed a small inconsistency here. And, uh, that namely is the fact that, um, we hadn't made it this far last episode. And that's because, well, in between episodes, I acc- well, not accidentally, but I went to record this episode, but when I went to, you know, edit and, you know, do all that jazz, the commentary didn't turn out too good, something happened with the microphone, basically, so, uh, yeah, we- <laughs> we couldn't upload that episode, so, uh, yeah, I'll have to explain exactly what happened last episode, uh, in full, greater detail later, but... Uh, for now, I think that suffices, but... Oh no, okay, can't go too close to that mud. Okay, good. I need to get this head shot. Ugh. Oh yeah, I should probably take a picture of this guy, shouldn't I? Fire Wizard, alright. Yeah, if you couldn't tell what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to... Uh, figure out all these elemental wizards. so alright, this one... <laughs> that face, though. <laughs> Alright, these uh, spell casting monsters can be found all over Hyrule. They use their fire rods to hold fireballs or to summon flaming monsters that have been known. Oh, and have been known to severely raise the temperature around them. The weather. Okay, the weather is normalized once the wizard robe is defeated. Alright, well, uh, let's take this guy out real quick. No, I was not close enough to him. But. Mm, nope, okay. <laughs> Ah, uh, that- oh wow, that would've killed us! Shoot! <laughs> yeah. Uh, actually, uh, I probably should put on my helmet here, as that does grant me a little more defense. Uh, okay, the guy's behind us now. No, he's right there. Oh, shoot, what's he doing? What is he- oh, shoot! Uh... Okay, 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 what- wait, what, 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 what? What the heck is going on? There's fireballs waiting from the sky. <laughs> what? <gasps> um. All right, man. You have won my respect, but now you are dead, <laughs> and that is the end of his life. Uh. Oh, is that is firewood? I'm guessing. Yeah, firewood. Okay. So same thing, but shoots fireballs. Yeah, don't want that anymore. Uh, I'm. I don't really like these heavier weapons. Uh, so I'm gonna drop those two. I'm gonna keep the boomerangs, but yeah. Yeah, but it's it's good for um, it's it's good for status things. But yeah, so if you couldn't tell, what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna be exploring this like uh, little military camp, and we're gonna see uh, what is going on over here. Uh, getting everything done that we hadn't uh, last episode or between the episodes here. So, um, yeah, that guy just flew after that guy. <laughs> he had fire arrows too, I think. That Obama arrows, I'm not sure. Did he have fire arrows? Okay. Um, what else we got? Okay, there's quite a bit of stuff going on right here. I gotta quick get all bomb ale. Let's see if we can get a headshot. Up oh, now he's dead. Was that even a headshot though? I'm not sure. No, no, not a headshot. Shoot. That's disappointing. Uh, but okay, we need to get over to that chest. How did we not make that? We should have made that. Okay. There we go. 
Can money even do that? I don't know. Oh, mud. I thought you said money. I was very confused for a second. Uh, right. uh, this guy is right next to the edge of a cliff. You guys know what that means for Bacoblins. <laughs> oh, wait. He's still alive? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> this game is so inconsistent, dude. Either die or... <laughs> like, you're gonna die some way. So, pick your death sentence. Alrighty, come on, man. Alright, alright. Well, we have used almost all of our weapons already. Uh, and I think... Okay. Is there... Oh, okay, so we can make it over here. Go say, otherwise... How are we gonna make it back over there? But, um... Oh! Did not mean to do that. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Yeah, we could probably just teleport, but... I wanna see if I can get back over there. Probably. <laughs> And I'm guessing we can just climb up here. Alright, there we uh, go. Alright, I don't think there's anything left this way, though. As for this enemy camp, is there anything? Anything going on? No? Okay. Um, alright, I think that's it for this back area. Um, well, at least that very small section of the back area. Um, what is that? Okay, there's a hidden chest down here. What is inside this? Giant boomerang! Another one of them? I mean, I will take another one of them. I am not complaining, but... Um, oh, boy. <laughs> oh, man, alright. Uh, uh, oh, there... Okay, there's a rock formation over there. I want to explore that. Check that out before we take our leave. Uh, otherwise, uh, yeah, so... What else do we got right here? We have some lowlands right here. Some... This, lo this looks like it would be like a mining place, really. Not so much like a training bailiffs. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Wait, did that? Oh. Oh, all right. I am. All right, well, I am dead. <laughs> Going back into this, everyone. Continuing on. It's very da dangerous to approach enemies head on when they're low on hearts. So, okay. I mean, that's pretty yeah, smart. That's I mean, yeah, all right. Wait, yeah, so this is the military training camp. Then. Okay. Yeah. So the game overs aren't that bad. Yeah. All right. Um. Oh, shoot. That guy's trying to take us out. Oh. <laughs> I did not realize. Oh, wait. Whoa. 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 What? What the? Uh, what just happened? <laughs> That's great, actually. Wow. I just kept on going, though. I was. I just kept on going. That was great. Wow. Uh, it's raining. It's raining. It's pouring. Um, there is, uh, Bacobin over there, and that is a bomb. Yeah, a mob, not a Bacobin, sorry. Okay, might as well eat. Um, yeah, this, um, where is, yeah, omelet, there we go. There we go. Uh, oh. Um, another one? I mean, I'm not against that. But... There, oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! No, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Not on me. Not on me. No. No, you don't. Yes! Ha! You get... Wh I have no words. I have no words. The topaz is still gotten, though. Joke's on you, game! Ha <laughs> ha! I may not have been able to get back on you in Super Mario Galaxy, but I'm still living. Ha ha! Oh, yeah, Ruby too. I'm not sure if that's better than topaz or not. It is better? I mean, I guess that makes sense. Okay. I'm smack this guy a few times. I love how far they just fly every time I hit them. It's so much fun to just fling Bacoblins around place by place. Yep, not that, that guy's so. This is great. That's just a spiked Moblin spear, yeah? Yeah. 
I do like Moblin Spear, so I'm actually going to be using them. Actually, maybe not. That only does nine. Hmm, what do I think? What do I think? I'm going to go for the spear. See how long that lasts us. I mean, it's not like we're holding for damage right now. <laughs> we can... Yeah. I mean, he did. This guy doesn't even have a weapon, does he? <laughs> yeah, this guy doesn't even have a weapon. He's just like cannon fodder. Like, I'm not sure what he's doing. Yeah, he's, well, now he's dead. Fine. <laughs> there, there he goes. That was quite the fight right there. <laughs> that was quite the fight. I do declare. Uh, and soldiers, bro. Yeah, of course they still have the firework. I made sure that I wouldn't use them. I want to keep those rods for later. That's my drift. Right, let's see if this guy goes down as easily as his friends. Alright, what do we want to use? What do we want to use? Just stab him with this thing. Alright, there we go. No. Wait, don't you dare. Come on, man! <laughs> it's like, with my final breath, I'll make sure you don't get my specific loot drops. Joke's on you! Oh wow, I still live that. <laughs> this is a great episode, everyone. This is this is top notch quality entertainment, everyone. <laughs> oh, that's an octo. And now it's a dead octo. Uh what what is this guy have? Octo balloons? And tentacles. Oh. Yeah, genocide. That's what this is. Because <laughs> Moblin Genocide. Yeah, the horse. Yeah, the horse is mine. I'm not gonna kill the horse. Alright, what else we got? Is there anything over here? Is there anything over here? I want to make sure that I specifically explore everything because this game likes to hide things. Is there anything no? No? Okay. Check the skull out. And I think that's it for this military base, I do believe, maybe? No. No? No, I. Then we'll go to the tower, we'll see if we can scout any last things out. But, uh, shoot, it is raining, so this is gonna be fairly difficult. But, um, yeah, I think that's it for this area. It should not thunderstorm, I think it's just rain. That's right. All right. Um. Uh, now that we've got that, I think. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the. T oh shoot. Um. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. So we're gonna. Whoa. What was that? A choo choo? I think that was a choo choo right there that we just saw. <laughs> but yeah. So we're gonna go back to the tavern. We're gonna scout out anything last living, and then we're gonna go back to the uh quick camp. But before that, I do want to take a quick look at my map as since we acquired a towel we do have a new map so I haven't looked through that with you guys just yet so I did want to look at that and wow look at all this room yeah all right so basically what we found is um again just game pad not wanting to uh, all right there we go there we go yeah, so this is where we left off in episode 30, Within Stable. So we did do that shrine. We went this way, fought an ice whiz robe. Then we continued on to Minchi Woods. And then Paul called our way up here. And that was it. But now we've explored basically this whole training camp right here. And, um, yeah, there's some strong enemies up there. And I'm guessing that that's where... Uh, Death Mountain might be, maybe? I'm guessing, something like that. But, uh, yeah, so... <laughs> otherwise, if we, if we kept on going in this trail, there is a forest over here. It's called the Great Hyrule Forest, yeah. Uh, but it's separated into two sp spots. There's, like, this normal green, then there's this color. I'm not sure if that's going to be the clock forest or the Lost Woods. Yeah, and then there's, like, this wounds thing right here so one of these are the clock force one of them is the lost woods i'm guessing Maybe the but lost yeah anyways our plan is going to be to follow this path over here continue on and then just you know make a circle right here to come back over to the wetlands uh, i know that it's been a very large detour that we have made but um oh we haven't made it over there have we I, I, as I was saying, I know that we've made 
quite a large detour in the last few episodes. But, um, oh shoot, what is going on over there? Yeah, it's going to... Oh wow, the lane has cleared up, lickety split. Ice arrows. I am. Yeah, I'm going to take those gladly. Anything else over here? I'd be very surprised if there's like nothing over here. Oh shoot, is that... Wait, is that not a guardian? It's not a guardian. It's not on. But it's in like the middle of nowhere. Alright. <laughs> I, I was like f really sure that that was going to be a guardian, but um, apparently not. Alright, yeah. I think there's... Oh shoot! <laughs> I always love using these bomb arrows because they just... Oh, updraft, 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 updraft! Fly! Fly, my Link! Fly! <laughs> okay. This guy's face. Okay. One guy lives <laughs> with 20 HP. Oh, wait, is this a whale drop? Yeah, Lizalfo's tail. Okay, that's good in elixirs. We haven't made very many elixirs, have we? Should probably get on that. Yeah, this guy is very mobile. I cannot... Okay, there. I was going to say, I cannot get... Oh, shoot. That guy just... <laughs> this is literally just Flying Bacoblins 2.0. That's actually just going to be the title of this episode. Flying Bacoblins 2.0. Because that's what this is. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, man. Um, Wow, that is... Um, what even is this body of water? I'm not sure, but... It's a very clean body of water. I love it. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, I think that's it for this area. I did want to go back, you know, to that pathway that we were uh, going to be following. So I think this is a fairly close to them. Um, so, oh. We are actually right next to Hyrule Castle right now. This is nuts. Um, yeah, okay. <laughs> Oh shoot, we are right there! <laughs> Dude! When I said we are making a long detour, I apparently was not kidding. Oh shoot, 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 that's not good for us. Wait, how can we paraglide if we have no stamina? Oh shoot, what's going on with them? Uh oh, that's not good for those people. <laughs> Wait, that guy's still living? Oh, come on, man. That's not right here. You know that you're supposed to die ASAP. Oh, shoot. That thing's actually... Yeah, there we go. Alright, talk to these guys. You've got away with the sword, don't you? I'll admit, I was maybe in a little over my head there. Thanks. Oh! Spicy mushroom rice bars. Well, that's three and a good cold resistance. Alright. Did I say anything? Think highly of that Mina is safe. I knew it wasn't smart to go treasure hunting in these boats. Alright. Well, um, this is where the path was taking us. So I suppose we follow it. Again, we are right next to Hyrule Castle. And I did want to actually say something about this before we end off. Is that I've actually really admired how this game, like, approaches game design. Like, I don't... Like, okay, one of the things I like to do, right, is... I'm sorry, I did not mean to use bomb arrows. But, yeah, one of the things I like to do is kind of analyze games or, like, levels in games and see why they do what they do. Uh, like, Mega Man and uh, the original Mario games are great at this. Because you... Well, not, not even just the originals, but even the new ones, they're great at this. You can just look at their level design, and it's so much... It's so smart. But, uh, you know, seeing as how Breath of the Wild takes... Oh. Well, as I was saying, <laughs> as uh, f Breath of the Wild, uh, as it kind of takes free roaming, I think it's great just how it does it. Well, you, you're actually free in this game. You can, like, once you get off that great plateau, you can go anywhere. Like, yeah, it tells us, okay, go this place, go to Kakariko. But you don't have to do that, and the game doesn't nag at you for not doing it. You know, like, Zero's Domain is right next to, you know, Kakariko, so that's obviously the one that they want you to do, but you don't have to. You could go to, G I don't know, like, Muroto Valley Force? I don't know. But, yeah, you could go anywhere you please, and... 
Uh, even the fact that you can go to Hyrule Castle first as uh, bad of a, as bad as an idea it probably is. Uh, the fact that they even give you that option, it feels very empowering. But uh, anyways, we have spotted a guardian in the path here, everyone. So uh, yeah, I think we'll wait. Actually, can we get close enough for a picture here? Yes, yes, we can. All right. What does it have? What does the Compedium have to say about this guy? Okay. The Sheikah of Ancient Hyrule develops this as a weapon to combat Ganon. Its six legs give it extraordinary mobility compared to the most recent vehicles, and its powerful laser provides far greater offense capability than conventional weaponry. Destroying the legs severely re reduces its mobility. Okay. So step one. Take out its legs. Just take out its legs and you're on your way, but, um... Alright, everyone. Well, we are all... We are gonna be taking that on next episode here. So, everyone, thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe if you have enjoyed the video. Comment if you have anything to say. Share with friends. Everyone, I'll see you next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And everyone, I'll see you then.